I'm Bolajang Thapa. I'm English teachers at Manthali Secondary School. I'm going to facilitate uh, uh, the poem every morning I wake today. First of all, I'm going to describe about a poet Dylan Thomas, who was born in 1908 in Swansea, United Kingdom. His father David was English professor at local grammar school and he left his schools at the age of 16. In that time, generally people who develop their career by informal education, to samayama business the manishru anupacharik sikshale apno career develop garthi. As the same result, Dylan Thomas who developed his career in informal education and he became a journalist. His mother who was religious and he was greatly influenced by John Donny and other metaphysical poets. Bisheshta unko ama adhyatmi kununthiyo ra bisheshta John Donny ra anya metaphysical jo adhyatmik poet haru athwa kabhi baata uni jyade prabhavit bane. He was motivated in English literature so that he left his job. In 1932, Bisheshta Saityatra Prabhavit Bhaira Unle Unai Se Bhattisma Aapno Pesa Jarnalis Patra Karita Chode. After that, he motivated and composed many poems like Every Morning I Wake. Dylan Thomas was an heir of English Romantic tradition in the 20th century. In English particularly focuses on imagination, emotion and feelings. In that times, Dylan Thomas, English Romantic Tradition ka yuta bishon satapti ka utra dhikari ka rupma, jasle kalpana, bhabana ra anubhav lai aapna poem baata prashtut garne jamar ko gare. He passed away in 1953 in New York due to cause of over drinking. Now we are going to discuss about of the poem in detail. This poem is an extract from Under the Milkwood where the speaker praised the girl for the protection and guidance of all the creatures in the world. Bisheshta you poem Milkwood banne play bata liye ka hun athwa natak bata liye ka hun Speaker Athwa Poet Kabile Bhagavan Lai Aflai Harek Manis Lai Samraksan Protection Gara Guidance Gara Banda Yuta Prathna Gariku Poemo Kabita Hoyu. Now I am going to present stanza wise analyze of the poem. In the first stanza, every morning when I wake, dear Lord, a little prayer I make. Oh, please to keep thy lovely eye on all poor creatures born to die. According to the first stanza, the speaker is a devotee of God and he knows the real power of the God. Bhakta Bhagavan ko bhakta hununsa ra Bhagavan ko bastabik shakti bujnunsa. So every morning he wakes up. And he makes a prayer to him for having mercy on every creature. Living creature like This poem is an appeal to God to love and keep the eyes of all living creatures. So the poet appeals God not only for his own protection but also for the protections of all poor creatures in the world between their birth and death. Tesele kabi Bhagavan sanga prarthana garnu unsa keval aapno samrakshan matre vai na yu vishwa samsar ma bhai ka harek living creature ko samrakshan ka lagi. In the second stanza, Dylan Thomas had written in this way. And every evening at sundown, I ask a blessing on the town. For whether we last the night or no, I'm sure is always touch and go. In the second stanza, the poet who suggests us that before going to sleep, the speaker prays to God 
But he is not say whether he will see them again in the morning. So he asked God to bless him. Dostro istanza ma sutno jano agadi. Boli palta biujan chau biujan da inu thasai na. Tarapani Bhagavan sanga prathna gar nonsa. Boli palta sakusal biujan a kalagi. Asirbad dinos vanera. The poet is unclear whether or not the night is the final night of the city's residence. Rakkavi aispasta ununsa. Tehi ratne antya uneo atwa weina. Bisesta milk hudka basin basi haruka lagi. But the poet prays the god would make everything rise and protect them from any danger. Tara kavi. भगवान संग प्रार्थना करनुं सा, वहाँ ले हर एक लाई, हर एक लाई संरक्षण करनुं सा। In the third stanza, Dylan Thomas had composed in this way: We are not wholly bad or good, who live our lives under milkwood, and thou, I know, wilt be the first. According to the third stanza. All poor creatures may be good or bad in course of living our everyday lives, but only God knows our best side. All poor creatures means all living beings or human beings in this poem. The speaker seems to be confident that God understands the better side of the milkwood people. He also prays to gods to look the positive side of the people, not the bad side. In the last stanza, Delin Thomas had composed in this way. Oh, let us see another day. Bless us all this night, I pray. And to the sun, we all will bow and say goodbye, but just for now. According to the last stanza, the poet hopes that the night will pass quickly and that the lovely day will return. So the poet bows down and prays to the girl to keep them alive throughout the night. The final goodbye symbolizes to the conclusion of the prayer. This time the speaker says goodbye. But he is aware that they will be temporary and the next day will be the new beginning by God's grace. Antim istanza ma kabhi asa garnu huncha, rat chaare bitos, asa lag do ghamai lo din aos, ra uaha bhagavan prati jhuknu huncha, ra prathna garnu huncha, मिल खुड का सभी मानी सरुलाई आशीर्वाद दिन होस त्योरात र अंतिम मा गुडबाई गुडबाई बनने शंभूल प्रयोग करनु भाई कुछ हाँ केवल कई छड़ी कलागी तही रात कलागी मात्रे गुडबाई बनुं सा र नया दिन को आगमन होस या भगवान ले तही आशीर्वाद दिन होस मने र प्रार्थना करनुं सा According to the stanza-wise analysis, we can summarize this poem in this way. This poem is a prayer to the magnificent God made by the tiny creature known as a human being. The speaker is a devotee of God and he knows the real power of God. So every morning, evening and night, he prays to the God for having mercy on every creature. According to the poet, God is the creator and destroyer of everything of this planet. The speaker prays to him to have mercy because he is immortal and almighty. The speaker prays to him to have mercy because he is immortal and almighty. Bhakta भगवान संग प्रार्थना करनो हुन्सा सबैले आशीर्वाद दिनोस किन बने भगवान तपाईं नै अमर हुन्सा सर्वशक्तिमान हुन्सा As a mortal beings we have to die but the blessing of God make our lives beautiful हामी मरणशील प्राणी भएर हामी एक दिन मर्नै पर्छ तर भगवानले यदि आशीर्वाद दिनु भयो बने यो जीवन सुन्दर बन्न सक्छ
द इनहेबिटेंट्स ऑफ द मिल्क वुड बो टू द सेटिंग सन जस्ट फॉर सेंग गुड बाय ओनली टू दैट इवनिंग दे होप टू सी द साइनिंग सन द फॉलोइंग मॉर्निंग दे वॉन्ट टू लिव एनोदर डे बाय द ग्रेस ऑफ गॉड अलोंग विद द वार्म ऑफ द सन इन अ प्रेयर पोइम द स्पीक अ कम्युनिकेट्स विद द गर्ड फॉर इज ब्लेसिंग एंड द गाइडेंस थ्रू आउट हिज लाइफ एंड इन टाइम ह्यूमन काइंड एंड क्रिएट्स कवि भगवान संग कम्युनिकेट कर पूर्ण यो मानव जीवन लशीर्वाद दिस् रही मार्ग में हिड़ाई रहोस्ने कामना कर इन द कंक्लूजन दिस इज स्पिरिचुअल एज वेल एज रिलीजियस पोइम गड इज ओमनी प्रेजेंट ओमनीसेंट एंड ओमनी पोटेन्ट सो The God controls and protects all the universe. Nishkar Sama, yo yo uta adhyatmi kavita ho. Bhagwan sarva shakti man, sarva bhayapi hununsa. Bhagwan le ne yo samsar lai niyantan garnu vai kusha. Banera kavita ma kavile ulle garnu vai kusha. We are at the end of this video. I hope this video will be fruitful, especially for great real students. If you have any feedback. Let me know in my comment section.